Welcome to Support Quick Launch for Control-M. In this video, we will discuss downloading software for Control-M, which is done primarily via the EPD site, also known as Electronic Product Distribution. Knowing how and where to download Control-M software can help you install and maintain the products quickly and effectively. To download product software, open your browser and navigate to the support homepage at bmc.com support. You'll need to log in first, if not done earlier, to gain full access to the site and content. Once logged in, select Product Downloads. You may be taken to the Export Compliance page. If so, fill in the fields with your information and click Continue. The main screen of the EPD site shows the applications that your support ID is licensed for. Here you can filter by product name or select one or more product categories to get the specific products you are looking for. Also, you can move through the list on the bottom right if there is more than one page of information. The Control-M for distributed system software is found either in Control-M Agent, Server EM, which are the core products for Control-M, or in Control-M Application Integrations and Control-M Manage File Transfer, which are add-on products. After you select one or more categories, remember to click Go to reset the view. Control-M Mainframe software is found under the Control-M Mainframe or Control-M Output Management categories. If you are looking for a specific product, type in some or all of the name and click Go. For example, if I enter Control-M Enterprise Manager and click Go, it shows just those values in the list. Once I click on Control-M Enterprise Manager on the right, I can then see the specifics for that product. This next screen presents several options including dropdowns for currently supported versions and platforms. Selecting one of these at the top lets you filter and display just that information if you know the version or operating system to download. Remember to click Go to change the view. The Products tab contains the most current release of the product and is typically what we recommend downloading. The Patches tab will display all the historical fix packs and patches for that version in case you need to install something older than the most current version. The Documentation tab provides one or more links to any version-specific documentation. If you have not seen the Quick Launch documentation video, please see that one for more information. When you are ready to download software, click one or more checkboxes on the left and then select the Download button. This downloads the files to your local system, typically into the Downloads directory for the user you are logged in as. From there, you will need to transfer the files to the relevant systems to perform the actual installations. Remember that any file transfer should be done explicitly in binary mode when using FTP. Also, consider saving your downloaded files into a shared directory at your site for later reuse if necessary. Before you actually install the downloaded software, it is always best to follow the installation documentation, which again can be referenced in the Quick Launch documentation video. Often there are multiple steps that need to be performed. Thank you, and I hope this helped you understand how to download Control-M software.